Hey friends, so earlier today, uh, someone gave me a book and as I was reading it, it shares of a story of a, a lady named Pamela Williams who recounts uh, a time where she sat down at her desk that she had at home and on it was a yellow sticky pad, much like these. I'm sure some of you have used them. I use them even right now to uh, keep my notes and to help me remember what I should say, but also we use them to write down deadlines, uh, maybe notes to, that you send, especially you know, maybe for those of us who are old enough uh, to write notes to each other when we would sit down in class. But uh, six years prior from that moment that she sat down, someone had given her this note. And it simply writes, I'm thinking about you and praying for you, Rebecca. And it kind of got me thinking, when was the last time somebody uh, displayed an act of kindness towards me? Or when did I especially share a moment of kindness with somebody else? I think of uh, kindness, you know, even God grants us little bits of kindness where perhaps you are driving and you see this beautiful sunset or maybe you are with your spouse and she gives you an unexpected kiss. Or maybe you're, you're sitting with your daughter and she comes over and gives you a bottle of water as you're out walking, something simple. You know, in this time as we're headed towards Christmas, we're wondering what can we give to others? Something that's free is that of kindness. Maybe a quick note just to say, hey, I'm thinking of you. Uh, or, or just whatever random acts of kindness. I know that in this world that we're living in, it seems that it is unkind. And God ultimately calls us to be able to share with one another kindness. The greatest gift that he came into this world is to come into this world, live amongst us, to be kind and to heal and to listen to others, especially the disenfranchised. Small acts, but created big reactions. I hope and pray that you are well. And as we head towards Christmas, may you grant the gift of kindness to somebody, not just this week, but from hereafter. In fact, I want to even challenge you, maybe every day, what is something that you can do? Perform one act of kindness every day. Proverbs says, anxiety in a man's heart weighs him down, but a good word makes him glad. May you be blessed. May you be kind. Have a great day. Take care.